I'm Sharice Nicole with CNicky.com. We are here at our favorite restaurant, Della Terra, in Beverly Hills, California, for a little cocktail and conversation with one of our favorites, Josea Chanchez from BET's The Game. So let's talk about The Game, right? Because I was telling Brittany that I love the title of the show anyway, because it can mean so many different things. Mm -hmm. So um, what is your interpretation of what The Game is? You know what? My interpretation of the game, and when you just look at it, it's, you know, the game of football. But then, you know, I interpret the game in itself as the game of life in a way. And um, the show is not really about football. It's about relationships and people who are living their day-to-day -day lives with these particular set of challenges each year, um, which is generally their arc, um, which much like most of us, you know, football players aren't any different than you and I. The thing that I've learned more specifically is that there's a set of rules that they play by and most often those rules are led by women. Um, the, the mom, the manager, the, the girlfriend, the wife, um, it's their safety net in a way that allows them to go out and do a lot of what they do on the field. Not all of them, but some of them rely heavily on um, their female counterparts in that way. So our show was really only about relationships. The background um, was football, but the foreground is the relationships of these you know, six people or seven or however many cast members we have now, but the, the relationships um, that they had and how these women in particular allowed these men to go do what they did best on the field. Absolutely. And I said this, and this is my, everyone's gonna have their own take of what they felt, how they felt about the series. But what I found is the evolution of nine seasons is I think that in the beginning, mm -hmm. all of the men, in the series chose the game of football over love. It was more of a priority mm -hmm. to them over love. And I think the evolution of nine seasons, it's kind of changing to where they're realizing that love and family are more important. Because the game changes, but you know what you build outside of the game will be consistent. Exactly. So, yeah. yeah that's, that's my... I get another point for that, right? That's. Mm. Uh, okay. I mean, everybody I mean, knows that. No, I mean, I mean, I think that that was really introspective as well. Profound. I mean, you can no. go to CNN right now and see that's going to be. See, I asked you that question. Screen, anybody. You didn't give that response. The president said that in his State of the Union address last night. Everybody's talking about that. That ain't no big deal. Whatever. Nobody's Whatever. nothing new. Yeah. Clearly, he's more like his character than um, you guys thought. Um, he's a hater. <laughs> I want to talk to you about like the final week, okay. the final week, the final day. Mm -hmm. What did that feel like? What were you thinking? The final week of the show was. It was it was weird. There were highs and lows. It was just high, low, high, low, high, low. And it was um, a lot of work. I had a lot of work um, on me that the final week of the show. Um, so I didn't have a lot of time to focus on what was happening, but it would creep in every now and then. Like when I went to my trailer or the restroom, I would just, you know, I would process the moment and it would hit me and then it would leave because I had to get back to work. But it was really, um, sad. It was really sad. And not because the show's ending. Cause I, I believe strongly that it's the best time for the show to end. Um, but because I'm not going to get to see these people on the daily basis like I normally got got to at that time. And then the conversation was changing because we were doing some, you know, some press and stuff up until that time. And then everybody wants to know, um, you know, generally it's, you know, are you coming back? Are you coming back? Are you coming back? Are you coming back? <laughs> and then in literally in, in one week's time, the conversation changed from are you coming back to what's next? And that was the first time I had to really answer that question or even process that question um, versus, you know, are we coming back? Is the network going to bring the show back? Will we be renewed into knowing that, you know, the show's not coming back and now, you know, what's next? So yeah. it was really sad. Right. Are we getting married? Are we having children? No, not right now, but, you know, it's got to happen soon for me because okay. I feel like I want to. I mean, I want to enjoy my youth and, you know, have my kids. Yeah. You know, I want to get it out of the way in a way. Well, people are, people are ready. 
People people are ready, you know, they're just waiting their opportunity. The babies is what? What y'all waiting for? <laughs> <laughs> what y'all waiting on? Y'all gonna breastfeed for us or something? What's happening? Huh? <laughs> people are waiting. What? Are we in love or what what's going on? Not in love, no. In love? No. No, I mean Then that's why people are waiting. Oh, for me to fall in love. It'll happen. Their opportunity. Soon enough. Shaquanda wants to know if she can get a chance, a date, you're her man crush Monday. To know, I don't know. Shaquanda, Shaquanda. at shaquanda.com wants to know. Is this a fictional yes. person? Well, why her name got to be Shaquanda? Because it just looks like a girl you would like. A girl named Shaquanda. Okay. I don't know if I'm should be insulted or what. You know something? He doesn't want to play along. I just feel like this interview has, has been over for a very long time. It was over when it started. You know, he's just he's such a hater. <laughs> it's fine. Sorry, Shaquanda. I tried. Okay, Shaquanda. Thank you for uh, tuning into the game. I'm Hosea Chanchez, and you are watching Coco Fab TV. Hey. Boom. What's up, guys? It's Hosea Chanchez from the game, the number one hit series that you guys made number one. Thank you. And you are tuned in to cnicky.com.